Hey there, everyone. This is Al Cowbling, Paper Mario, and am I gonna be the game today? I. Hmm. Am I going to be the game today? That's a valid. I don't think I will. Like, today we are entering into the castle. We kind of have a rough idea of how big this place is. Ooh, it's all deserted now. That's fun. Well, we'll see what happens. Alright, I'm gonna go inside this door, and I'm gonna bother that toad. Hey, how's it going? Just gonna place yourself in your talking spot before you speak? Also, you wait until you were outside before saying how there was nothing here but clothes? That was some weird scripting. Did I get anything? Would you like to take a quick- Oh, okay. Okay, so that's our inn now. It's pretty good. Please enjoy a rest. Uh, oh, there is a bed there. I, I didn't see it. There's a lot of stuff going on in that room. One of them is a bed. And he's my lookout. All right, great. I forgot if I used like healing yesterday. No, I ran all the way back to a uh, hard block, right. That's fine. Still fun to sleep. Here's the kitchen. Anything here? I don't know if I am. I'm not sure. You can jump around though. Can I grab a couple eggs? No, all right. Cool. Yeah, if you jump on a table, you get to see the ceiling. That's pretty fun. Music has been very spooky, so you know, I hope no one is too scared now. <laughs> this is the, yeah, this is the showroom. Look, you gotta go everywhere because uh, Bowser might be anywhere, you know? Alright, let's put on our watch. Ooh, do you think the room is lighter, like in the main hall, if you're in watt walking? Let's find out, because like everything is pretty dark. Okay. Watts light only works in pure darkness. If there's a little light, can't tell, you know? It's just not gonna happen. All right, that's fine. It is not a real criticism. It's fine. All right, I got this choice here, though, you know? There's like so many doors. And we're gonna go through all of them. Just in case. Hey, here's a big box. Can I put all my stuff? Oh. It'd be pretty funny if you had the option of just empty emptying your entire pockets. Just kind of put everything in there. And it's just like a whole bunch of prizes for someone you don't know. Alright, gonna smash on this blue thing. I still don't understand this blue thing. Because it's just like supposed to be like a cloth put on the table or something? A tablecloth? But like not the main tablecloth? I don't know. What was in this door? I don't- oh yeah, the library. So anyone here that wants to get their head smashed? Uh, I, I can't help but feel like I am wasting my time doing a thorough re-walk through everything, but I'm doing it. Well, there's a one-up up there. How would I get up there? Like, you can't move on to something if you do a double jump. Oh, 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 these books are gonna serve as platforms. Like, that's gonna be what, like, what, five lives in my, um, in my inventory? But yeah, <laughs> I'm going to be ready for Bowser. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so I can play basically as degenerate as I want. Now, what I have to remember though is that it's a one up and you're back with like 10 lives, right? But I also have one Ultra Shroom. I have one Ultra Shroom. If I had access to a check, I think I could get more. So that's a little unfortunate, but whatever, it's fine. Welcome to the flip around room. We did it. We found this place and we're going to keep it, all right? Over here is gonna be Princess Peach's room, which now that I think about it, this feels like a weird place to have it. But it's more of a lounge that also has a bed. So, uh, uh. We can go here, we can jump and start all over again. Okay, see, if they, if they had planned for you to be able to, like, leave this place for whatever reason, I bet uh, that's where it would happen. Alright, Mario does not have the ability... Well, Mario doesn't know that there's anything there. And unlike most RPG and sometimes un-RPG uh, games, Mario respects the privacy of homes uh, and doesn't just ruffle around randomly in the stuff. That's pretty good. 
This is the hall that kind of gets really framey, and it's one of the earliest locations in the game. It made me really worried. But I feel like for the most part, uh, the game ran fine. Oh, that, see, that's a lot more credible, especially with Bowser being there. That's a lot more credible. Me too, honestly. Something weird about Bowser calling Mario Little Man. That is, I, there's something weird about that. I don't know, maybe there isn't. Oh, geez, we're just doing it? Okay. He's invincible. Invincible is how you need to say it. All right, so if he gets his snap up, that's when we get down. Got it. Pop on the head. Oh yeah, you didn't like that, huh? Well, let's see how you feel about it once Bow starts slapping you around. Nope, we want the big, the big, the big slaps. I feel like it's been a while since I used your command input. Okay, so yeah, he has armor. So, that was probably not- Ooh. Ah, you- Oh, yeah, yeah, you missed! You big- You big boober? That's right. The big words are coming out. I guess it makes sense that Bowser would have armor. Alright, so yeah. Wah is just more efficient. It's fine. We're learning! That's a big zap. Big electrified touch. Alright, and you hate that! Uh, Fully operational style. What a weirdly specific thing to say. <laughs> it is. Oh, he's having fun though. All right, oh, I want to have fun too. Star beam. Ooh, it's free because it has a very specific use, probably. All right, summoning the power of all the stars. Night of the round. Uh, here we go. Oh, he hates that. Yes. <laughs> He's worried. Oh, that's good. Okay. Yeah, no, we rumbling. Here we go. That's how I express my displeasure. Just a big ol' zap. <laughs> Alright. Watch out, this is gonna be serious. Ooh! Wow, a status effect. Incredible. Truly, I am an impressed little guy. Here, let me jump on your head a few times. Which is something that would not work typically in a Mario game. I feel like I must uh, insist. Uh, but yeah, I could take a tonic, or I can, it's just one damage. It's like, who cares? Oh, that's a lot of healing. It's pretty scary. And then I'm digging that delay here. Should I all man? I think it makes sense. Like, I took just a little bit of damage. I think you're supposed to heal status effects, right? Yeah, there you go. And you know, I recovered a little bit of everything. It's not the worst thing in the world to do, I don't think. Like, it's a lot less damage, but it's survival, so it's all good. Alright, there we go. He's powering up. He's yucking it up. I guess he thought it was a fluke or something. Well, here we go. Let's fluke him again. I wonder if he's on like a... Like a strict pattern or what? I don't know. I have no idea. Because I feel like after he does the, the, the thing and then you do the beam, it's like you get it. You're always going to just do the beam after he gets invincible. Oh, that's an attack. Okay. That's interesting. You have many things you can do. I can bounce on your head twice. Those are my options. Okay, uh, that's fine though. Yeah, he's poisoned, whatever. It's okay, we're good. Yeah, you're gonna get hurt. That happens. Pop and bounce. Whoa, yeah, that's right. I just killed Bowser, I guess. Well, that was so much XP. What the hell? Well, I got a lot of choices what to do with my... <laughs> I'm so mad stomping. Uh-huh. All right. I'm ready for round... <laughs> Bowser, you're not very believable when you do things like that, you know? I'd say, why doesn't he just throw her out the window or something if he wants to get rid of Bowser? But he wants to, you know, he wants to get something going on with Peach, so. 
that's kind of like, like, so in a way, we can kind of be sure that, you know, she's probably going to be relatively fine, all things considered. Uh, I don't know. I mean, that that, that is his one, like, uh, hard to play poker with. Oh, look at that. He could also just stay in the air, like, forever. Well, I don't know, like, what powers the clown car, to be perfectly honest. Like, I don't know what... You know what? I don't think I'm going to use multi-bounce. I want Mega Jump. Can I clear two? Can I make room for two? I don't know if I'm allowed to jump on him normally. Do power bound jumps. I mean, that sounds like what I kind of want to do. I just need to free up one. Um, I can do without the speedy spin at this point. Okay. Yeah. Let's give that a shot. Hopefully I don't regret it. Maybe I will. That's the fun of it. Yeah, but I... So, if there's ever, like, part of the boss fight, suddenly a situation where there's a ton of targets, well, I got my buddies to, like, handle that, hopefully. Like, that's kind of the plan here we're going with. As we're going up, the spiral staircase. Oh, I don't know why that's so much, like, hiccups, I guess? I don't know how else to describe it. This is a very thin bridge, and I wouldn't just be going on it myself. <laughs> wow. Uh, just stepping right into the arena here. Oh, I was gonna press a button. Long range, a special arena. All right, uh, button it. Get out of here, bridge. This is a fun animation. This feels very Mario 64, like, but like different. But like, it's like the vibe is there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, <laughs> that's a fun laugh. Okay. All right. Uh, thanks for your wisdom. Power up. Yeah, it's just a spell. Oh, we're, we're we're on the clown platform. That is fun. Oh jeez. Okay. All right. And here we go. Mega Bowser is on the house. So here's the... Is this gonna be like the real fight? I mean, he's not gonna use the star on, so it's just straight up, hey, it's us. We're gonna try power bounce right before landing. Alright. I'm not sure how much damage I did. Like, I'm assuming he has defense. Alright, this... Whoa, jeez. Uh, okay. <laughs> Alright. I'm actually going to tattle, because I want to know if he has defense, and, like, just what I did was not really conclusive. Alright, tattle me up. It's the evil King Bowser. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, he has two defense. Okay. Uh... Yeah, I feel like my normal attack would be better than what I just did there. Well, two, so normally I do six. There I did three. I don't know. Alright. Beefed up already, man. That's hardly fair. Okay, so that all, uh, that still will happen. Alright. Great. Um, yeah, let's compare then. Let's just do a normal jump. Yeah, see, that's six damage, but it took less hops. <laughs> How nice of you to just spell it out like that. <laughs> like, why would you do that? Alright, well, here we are. I don't know what's going on, but I got a beam. I'm gonna shoot you in the bum. Well, except the shots from up. The reverse bum. That's right, Bowser. I just called you a butthead. No, I think the beam comes from the floor, actually. 
that's kind of mean. Okay. Oh, is the princess gonna do something? Brave Mario! Stars, what good are they? Is Twing gonna show? Ah, right, right, I was saying it! <laughs> Sweet. Ooh, am I gonna have, like, the princess as a partner? That'd be pretty rad. But right now, they're just kind of having fun. Look at that texture running on the floor. Whoa! Okay! Okay, okay, this, this is pretty cool. Oh, you got dash, and I cannot switch. I got dash. I don't have a uh, commands or any. You did it. <laughs> yeah. I was, I was pretty sad. You got focus though. Focus on Twink. Gonna make him stronger. This feels not so much a fight as a cutscene with interaction, except the interaction is as fun. All right, because yeah, like she's gonna throw this power block, I guess. I saw this attack in Toadette's Angry Game. All right, focus, dash, on the noggin. Here we go. That is the princess's power. She has the ability to focus a man's innate boiling rage. <laughs> I mean, yeah, like, this is neat, but the fact that it is all just completely scripted, uh, you know, it's kind of silly. Like, unless I'm supposed to be blocking the blocks, like, I haven't tried, to be perfectly honest. Do you think it doubles, or do you think it just, like, adds one each time? Guess we're gonna find out! Uh, big block violence. <laughs> There's something really funny about that. Well, see, if I was in full control, I'd take Peach's turn first so that, you know, he'd be stronger during that attack, but I can't, I can't tag, yeah, like in a normal fight. That, that, like, that's what I mean, like, I have zero control. This is a, and, you know, like, I get it. It's really cool, but it's a bit slow. Okay, so she just wishes. Okay, just, hey Star Kid, just get like invincible, super strong power. She would do it. Like she's 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 a big fan of Mario, and Mario is nothing if not one of the many avatars of violence upon the world of video games. And so Star Kid Twing just kind of ran through her body and tore her apart. Never heard about Cammy anymore. I don't know if she appears again in later games, to be honest. Yeah. No, I mean, no, I mean, yeah, I, okay. This feels like an extremely unnecessary step, but I get it, it's cool. Sometimes things that are cool don't need to be things that are necessary. I mean, that's almost what cool means. I just think it's a bit long-winded, but it's fine. It's like a big climactic part of the game. I don't know, I just... Meanwhile, Bowser's <laughs> just sitting there yucking it up. <laughs> just, hey! Look at that, he felt that. Hey, it's old man. See, there's a reason the game chose old man, and it's because it's the first one. It doesn't have anything to do with my decisions or gameplay decisions in the game. Twink, your name doesn't start uh, end with R. We can't call you Twinkar. That's not a pun. It's nothing. Which again is just kind of silly because now I can uh, now I can use the star beam, Peach Beam. 
Okay, that sounds fun. I'm gonna peach beam you. I don't know what that means either. Yeah, well, my health is back. I think I didn't lose. I don't actually know. Sure. All right. Oh yeah, well the damage I did is still there. So okay, star beam isn't even there anymore. Peachy beam. Here we go. Yeah, we got a twink in the middle and everything. Big cylinder. Big particle effects everywhere. There you go, you used up your turn. Good job, buddy. What about his multibomb? Would that go? Maybe if I charged him enough. Ah, I'd rather just hit with Twink. Like, honestly, like, that's just the reality. Twink, what? The little floating little baby I know that's made of sheer energy. That's colored yellow. It turns out there's two of them. It's really weird. You idiot! You absolute buffoon! Thank you, Melody, by the way. I deserve none of the work. Pop in. Yeah, still has armor. Like, there's. You got, like, one guy that's good against armor, so it's a little silly, I feel like. Like, that's just kind of like how things kind of deteriorate. Well, I think that healed up for all the damage I did to you. That's pretty cool. I do have defense down powers, though. Like, if I had D down jump right now, I would probably do the whole 10. Like, I'm assuming you still get, like, your, all your attacks. Oh, as long as it keeps attacking me, I guess that's fine. I, I didn't think that Bowser would have armor. I know that's pretty foolish of me, but that's the world I live in. Hey, at least I removed my multi-hop, you know? At least I can make that claim. You know what, Bowser? I know you really like this plan of yours, and you know, I, I understand why you want to keep trying it. But if Peach Beam animation is kind of long, and I'd rather do another one. <laughs> That's pretty mean. But here we are. Alright, alright, so yeah. No damage there from Mario, only a little tickled by a lightning guy. Oh no! Alright, I got poison. I honestly I don't really care. This is not whoop. Like basically I'm just waiting out until I'm below uh ten and I'm just gonna um, do something. That's called smooch. Meanwhile, now I've got a number bar to look at that's like straight out of final fight. And I'm finding that extremely distracting. Yeah, see, so this is probably a good smooch time. So let's smooch. Here we go. Smooch. Oh, it's not at the bottom anymore. So it's just pressing up. It doesn't just get me there. Is it, like, powered smooch? Like, I mean, I've heard that you were all powered up in some way. It doesn't matter here. Got it. That's fine. Here we go. We're doing things. You're full of electricity. You healed for 30? That's kind of mean. And then we just kind of wait there for a minute, because it takes a second for the poison to trigger. I don't know why. It's pretty good. Hopefully, there's a limited amount of time this guy can heal, because this could get really tiresome really fast. Alright. Let's do this again. No, I did the wrong thing! No, I I completely brain farted. That was a complete brain fart. I... Ah, uh, man. Alright, maybe I can do that then, since I messed up. Ugh, I feel bad. Alright, whatever. I wish your buddies could use items. Like, I feel it would make me more likely to want to use them. Alright. Uh, and I can't smoosh anymore. Uh, 
Alright, well... That brings me back up over the limit at the very least. Like, over, like, instant death limit. Meanwhile, I'm wasting my turns, though. I could be using that are powered up, but... Alright, I'm at the precipice of death again. And I lost... Oh, I'm not powered up anymore, so that was a waste, too. It's pretty good. I'm gonna use the Super Storm again. I feel like I'm wasting my time, though. Uh, Alright. Yeah, because now he does that again. Like, it's just... It's not a very interesting gameplay thing. You're just like, oh, you use that attack. I guess I use this attack. We did it! Wish melody triggered more often. Alright, I guess old manning here would make sense. I don't know how you time that. Whether I just heal up with 10 life every time, or use this now, now, basically makes no difference whatsoever. Okay. So, I guess my loadout is probably bad for this, but... I'm gonna be real, this fight kinda sucks. I don't know, like it's just... Unless there's something I'm not seeing that I'm not understanding. It's not it's hard to time lightning. Items at all? I mean, will my one up still work? That's pretty rude. I mean, like. Okay. Oh, he's super beaming? I feel like my options are somewhat limited at this point. Like, if my buddy can't do anything. Like, I have to do that, otherwise I can't do anything. This is a really weird fight. Sweet. I don't know, I think I'm bad lost. Well, one life down. Like, I'm gonna be kinda counting. Okay, so, even with items off, I still have this ability. Well, that's good. That's right, hear that delivery, and my items are back. Like, are, th are those related? I don't know. Yeah, that's what I have, so. I could, old man. 
maybe it's best to keep doing damage, and as I die, I might get to the third level that'll let me smooch. Kind of like a few lives in. That's the hope at this point. I don't know if that's going to happen, let's be real. I'm in peril! Yeah, like, I don't have access to smooch, and I think that's what I want. Alright, I guess that's what I'm doing. Yeah, because you die at the end of the turn, not like... Well, wait, Bowser's probably just gonna kill me. And, okay, he's not gonna kill me. No, yeah, oh, well... That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate for Melody to save me from the lightning, but, you know what, whatever, it's fine. I think, I think it might be fine. Have three more spare lives. Oh, but Bowser's almost dead. I didn't notice that. I really got him low. Yeah, next turn, he's dead. Just straight up. Okay. <laughs> That's weird. Uh, I can't- no, okay. Especially if he just does that with his turn. What? I mean, I understand why he would do that. You know, that's his I'm invincible move, and he didn't notice that I just remove that <laughs> status every single time. Look, it's hard being a massive colossal dragon turtle king, okay? Sometimes you don't have time for pattern recognition. Although it's kind of silly that at the end of the day, Watt is the one to do the final hit. You know, Watt, the Lil Spark. Oh, that's oh, the way his arms are moving. Oh, he's tiny. He's on his belly. <laughs> oh no. Imagine coming to that realization with your goals. <laughs> I didn't get star points.